Hey, good morning everybody, it's Mike, and thanks for jumping on here with me this morning. Those of you that have known me for a little while know that over the past years, I've lost about 45 pounds. And uh, this isn't about me this morning, it's more about the games that we all play inside our own heads. Uh, a guy last night asked me what I get asked a lot. He, uh, he said, wow, you look great. How'd you lose so much weight? <laughs> what do you mean, how did I lose so much weight? Uh, so I told him, well, you know, I tried to be nice about it. I, I know why he's asking. I'm going to get to that in a second. Uh, so I said, well, you know, I, adjust, I adjusted what I eat. I adjusted how much I eat, which both need to be adjusted. And I increased my exercise level. I did those three things. That's what I did. Um, <clears throat> the look on his face at that point was of total disinterest. Matter of fact, I see that look before. I see that look every day. Uh, it's the same look I get from you when I say, get up, get dressed, and get your little fanny to work, not in that home of yours. And then once you get here, spend two hours a day on your marketing and one hour a day on your follow-up. And then I don't really care what you do the rest of the day because I know it's pretty much going to get taken up with appointments, problem solving, all the stuff that comes when you get up, get dressed, go to work, and practice two in one. That look of blankness, vacancy, total and complete disinterest. See, the games we play inside our head? Uh-huh. I don't think that guy last night was really being straight with me. I think that what he was really saying in a very nice, polished, seemingly very interested in me and happy for me kind of way was, uh, no, 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 not the hard stuff. Show me the shortcut you took to do that. And when I didn't want to share a shortcut with him because I don't have one, if there was one, I would have taken it, but there wasn't. I had to, hold on a second, <laughs> Excuse me, I had to sneeze. Live TV. Okay. Uh, when I didn't want to share him a sh with him a shortcut, because there's not one, if there was, Lord knows I surely would have taken it, folks. I would have. Uh, he didn't want to hear it. He just totally, completely checked out of the conversation as if he was the one. I didn't bring it up. He brought it up. I don't walk around bringing it up all the time. I really don't. But people ask me, and it would be impolite not to answer them. But before I get the answer out of my mouth, already gone vacant. Just like you. No, 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 no. Other than that stuff, Mike, other than the get up early, get dressed, get to work, and practice two in one every day, other than that, what else you got for me? I'm like, well, I don't really have anything else for you. The simple truth was, how did I lose 45 pounds over the last year? Well, the, it's, the simple truth was, I just changed my daily actions. That's all I did. I changed what I eat, I changed how much I eat, and I changed my exercise program. And the great thing about it is, you know what? You can too. You can. No matter what it is in your life that you're dissatisfied with right now, you can change it. It could be losing weight. For some people it is. For other people, they don't have an issue there. Okay. It could be getting in better shape just physically more fit. Okay, for some people, some people are already there. It could be personal relationships in your life. Could be. Some of your relationships you're not that happy with. You can change that. You can start today. 
It could be, it could be your business. I mean, after all, this is supposed to be a business call, right? It could be selling more homes. I need to sell more homes to make more money to do things in my life that I find important to me and to the people I care about. Whatever it is, you, you can do it. You can, just like I did. And I was there in my real estate business at one point too, and it all changed. Well, it didn't really change. See, this is the point that I want to make. So if you're daydreaming right now, pay attention, because this is it. It didn't all change. I changed. In my real estate business, how did I go from really not doing very much to doing more than anybody in the world? I changed. Not everybody else, not something else, no outside forces, the market didn't get better, I didn't learn a shortcut. I changed my weak ass ways. How did I lose 45 pounds over the last year? I didn't bump into a secret, I didn't go on any big diet program. I changed my weak ass ways. And you can too. You just have to decide what habits you're determined to change. Because you know the old thing, right? If you want what you've never got, you have to do what you've never done. Well, that's an old saying because it's true. Things that aren't true, people stop saying after a while. It just sounds stupid. What actions are you going to change? What actions are you going to start taking every day? Because if the way you've done it hasn't worked for you, I don't know. Is it crazy to think that maybe you need to do it a different way? Maybe the way that you've thought of doing it isn't the best way to do it? in regards to your real estate business, why don't you try it my way? Give it six months. I'm going to almost promise you it's going to work better. Why? I tried it your way too. It didn't work very well for me. It doesn't work very well for other people. It's not working very well for you. Are you willing to change it? Because nothing else has to change. You and I have to change. So stop looking outside yourself. Stop. See that guy last night? He wanted me to tell him the secret. Well, here's the secret. The secret to him is inside him, inside his own head. Just change yourself, change your habits, and things will change with you. Um, if you've ever read the book, Atomic Habits, if you haven't, I would. If you have, I'd read it again. But one of the main things I took out of that book, I've got it written down right in front of me right now, I look at it every day, is change your habits, change your life. Change your habits, change your life. That's just true. That's all I did in anything that ever improved for me. It's all I did. And then I try to reconcile that against one of the most true things that I've ever heard. Successful people simply do what other people are unwilling to do. Change your habits, change your life. Yeah, well, successful people simply do what other people are unwilling to do. Unfortunately for that guy last night, I didn't have the secret sauce for him. I didn't have a magic pill. I didn't have the shortcut through the woods. And he was instantly disappointed and then did not want to talk about it anymore, was not interested beyond that. Once he discovered that I wasn't going to share the shortcut through the woods with him, he checked out of the conversation. I guess each of us gets to decide, right? I mean, it's your life, it's my life, we get one shot at this. Uh, what do you want that to be? And I guess the good news is it can be pretty much whatever you and I decide we want it to be. As long as I'm willing to make my habits aligned with what I say I want. And folks, I guarantee you this. The day you do that, you will be going out there and making it happen for yourself.